Hello. Alright, so my name is Anthony Vine. Howdy y'all, Jacob back. Um, Arthur here, back with another engineering video. So, um, just a quick introduction to what I'm going to be talking about today is, um, I'll be introducing you to you guys about a, um, the cycles of, uh, four-stroke engine and how an engine basically works. And, you know, just some basic principles of, uh, what goes into an engine cycle. And, um, you know, of also different parts of the engine, why they're important, and um, so let's start off with uh, a brief explanation of an engine. So um, an engine is basically a machine that converts um, a form of energy and usually in a form of fuel mixture or other fuels into a mechanical energy and by going through a series of cycles. So this is a four stroke straight line four cylinder engine. Uh, as you can see, there's four pistons connected to the crankshaft. The reason it's called a four-stroke engine is because it actually goes through four uh, cycles. And um, and each cycle has its own um, purpose of, um, of use. So the first stroke is the intake stroke. And this is when the fuel-air mixture is um, put into the cylinder as the piston is on its way down. And then the next stroke would be the combustion stroke. Once the fuel and air mixture is in the cylinder, the piston or piston will push up, which will compress the, um, the fuel to air mixture. And then the next stroke would be the, um, you could call it the combustion stroke. And this is when the spark plug goes off and the fuel air mixture um, explodes. And this will create um, gases, and that's what the exhaust stroke is for. This is when those gases can be released. Through going through and repeating these four strokes um, um, multiple times per second, and um, this basically allows the engine to you know convert the fuel mixture into mechanical energy so just i'm just going to quickly go through a uh, different parts of the um, engine um the pistons are on the crankshaft which is connected to the timing belt up here which is connected to the camshaft in here it's hard to see, but it's underneath the rocker arms that are up here. The camshaft um, has cams set at different angles um, to make the timing for the rocker arms correct so that the valves open at the right time. And here, interestingly, we actually have an engine that I built with um, a kit that um, Mr. Magni has provided us with. And uh, as you guys could see, the the um the crankshaft at the bottom is connecting the piston rods and connecting the pistons going up and down, creating this motions and um kind of indicating the different four cycles of um of the engine. And as you could see, um the sparking lights are indicating the spark plugs, and and it is very important that the timing of this um the uh, the timing is correct for an engine because if the spark plug goes off at the wrong cycle at the wrong time at the um during the cycle, it will create a huge problem for the engine and sometimes breaks down the engine. Well, there you go, the cycles of an engine and how an engine basically works and different parts of the engine. Thank you so much, and please come back for more videos in the future. Thank you.